So a magnitude 8.8 earthquake and tsunami just hit Russia, among the strongest ever recorded on Earth. Fortunately, no deaths or widespread damage. But did you know this tsunami also managed to travel backwards in time? Sort of. The epicenter was here, just off Russia's eastern coast, 11.24 a.m. Wednesday morning, local time. The explosive power of that quake radiated out in all directions, eventually bringing the first tsunami waves to Hawaii hours earlier, at approximately 7.30 p.m. Tuesday evening. How does that work, exactly? Well, I'm glad you asked. We all know that when you travel west-east or east-west, you're crossing time zones. Up an hour, down an hour. But that tsunami trip from Russia to Hawaii requires all that energy to cross the international date line, where the time cycles 24 hours back instead of one hour forward. Cross it from east to west, and you advance a day. But cross it from west to east, and you go back a day. Which explains how an earthquake that strikes at 11.24 a.m. might only make landfall as a tsunami the night before. Hence, the time-traveling tsunami. Sort of.